For most of history, much of the sky was hidden, for there are many kinds of light our eyes can't see. And despite the use of powerful technologies that made this light visible, the sky remained veiled because our atmosphere blocked much of the light from reaching the ground. But there was a plan. Four special telescopes that could fly above the atmosphere and into space, where they could see the universe more clearly. Each one gifted with special abilities to see part of the hidden light. Joining forces, they would reveal a more complete picture of the universe around us. They were the Great Observatories. The Spitzer Space Telescope created to see the infrared universe. But because much of the infrared light comes from relatively cool objects in the cosmos, there was one condition on which Spitzer's special power rested. It had to be very, very, almost ridiculously cold in order to see the infrared world. Otherwise, the telescope's own heat and that of the Earth around it would overwhelm its special abilities. But Spitzer was up to the challenge. Once launched into space, high above the infrared-absorbing atmosphere, it journeyed far from the warm, infrared glow of Earth. It shielded itself from the sweltering sun and chilled out using a special cooling contraption it had brought. And as Spitzer cooled down, the infrared sky came into view like never before. With its power of infrared sight, Spitzer could see through clouds of dust in space to show the places where stars are born. Spitzer even studied alien planets in other solar systems, something even its creators never designed it to do. Together with the other great observatories, Spitzer helped reveal many distant and fascinating places across the universe. But after several years, Spitzer's special cooling contraption ran out of juice meaning it would soon warm up. Would this mean the end of our hero's observing days? Not Spitzer. There was still plenty of infrared things it could see just fine. And it just wouldn't, just couldn't quit. Many years later, having revealed a whole side of the universe we would not have seen without it, NASA's Infrared Great Observatory retired. But because of their success, Spitzer and its space telescope super friends would not be the last of the great observatories. Soon, another powerful infrared observer would follow, taking up the legacy of those that came before.